Have a blessed Saturday, everyone. Baby Jay here from Tucson, Arizona. So today, I promised yesterday, I'm going to talk about COVID. And I will talk about how we're going to increase our immune system by using what we have at home. Okay, we don't have to buy, you know, any expensive stuff, but we just have to change our lifestyle and you take some supplements that are proven by science that actually help. So none of this... Um, food or lifestyle change by itself is curative or therapeutic okay it's by using and all of these things that works okay so because covid is novel right there's so not much well we know more than two years ago but still we a lot of these things i'm gonna talk about that was not really um, studied about COVID, but it stud was studied about other viruses because, you know, viruses behave the same thing. Hello, Tita Eve. Good morning. Thank you for joining from Laguna. And then, hey, Carol. Thank you for joining from Igbaras. And of course, Tita Mimi. Hi, Renz. Thank you for joining from Manila. And um, so I'm using uh, my new phone. It's iPhone, and I'm not used to iPhone, so I don't. Sometimes I, I really could not read, you know, the people who are joining us. So if you leave a, me, a message or an emoji, then I know you are, you are present during the prayers. It's just so. I, I, it makes me happy when, you know, people are actually taking their time, right, and praying for others. Uh, so, the lifestyle change that I'm gonna talk about is number one. You know, COVID is a metabolic problem, right? They It makes our body inflame. So the thing that, you know, sometimes, you know, some of us are kind of overweight. So when we are overweight, our body is already in an inflammatory state, right? So we need to lose some weight, okay? But at the same time, we need to exercise and i was telling you that all you need to do is do brisk walking 15 minutes three times a week the more the better but don't do an intense exercise like you know um uh like uh, weight lifting weights or you know doing like 200 push-ups a day because those are unhealthy they create more inflammation because your body will produce cortisol when you are working so hard because you know you, your body is in a flight mode so it produces this cortisol which causes inflammatory effect right so the um, the other thing that we need to um, learn is sleeping okay sleeping at least 7 hours a day and and the best part of our sleep is before midnight so try to sleep before midnight I know I'm talking this and you guys are awake at 10 o'clock but try to sleep before mid midnight and because the amount of sleep that you uh, have on that time is the slow sleep where you dream so your mind is actually relaxed and regenerating you know your body your tissues so very important that you know we have enough sleep and you know taking naps is also very important so if you have time you're retired take naps Hi, Maria. Thank you for joining from Arizona. Hi, Tito Elmer. Thank you for joining from Texas. Oh, before I forget, thank you so much for those who uh, subscribe already to Likaw Sa Kagaw um, in English. You know, beware of germs um, because I need to go to YouTube, okay? I can't do this from FB Live and change, uploading to YouTube. It's too much work for me. And I don't have that time because, you know, I'm doing full-time work and I'm going to start school and there's so much I do. <laughs> but prayers is important to me. So if you help me make my life a little easier so we could do other ministry, right? Then that will be wonderful. So um, the other thing is it's really lifestyle change lifestyle change because now we could not conglomerate we could not party even though if you're vaccinated because of the delta variants not of vaccines right 
covers that, especially if you have Sinovac, Pfizer, they don't really cover the Delta variants. But still, if you get the COVID, you have, we're hoping you will have uh, minimal symptoms, but that's what we uh, observe in the hospital. Those who are vaccinated will actually have minimal symptoms, mild symptoms compared to the one who was not vaccinated. You know, they're the one who needed oxygen. They're the one who needed intubation. And um, so, you know, limit your uh, partying. You know, we cannot party still until we just do it with our own family, our small group. Uh, you know, when we had, you know, la last year, the same group you should have. And when you are inside, okay, be sure that you wear mask, okay, because using masks is preventing the amount of virus that could go inside our system to overwhelm our system so as much as possible if you have surgical masks is good but even cloth masks that would still hinder the uh, amount of virus that goes into inside our own body and if you are inside the house open your windows you know in the philippines it's so hot you know, and uh, every, everyone wants to use their um, AC, but then when you use the air conditioning, your house doesn't have an AC. You don't have a filter in your house unless you do. So the, the air there is stagnant. You're just, the air is just going around and around, but they are dirty air, right? They are not filtered. So you need to open your windows, you know, and let the fresh air comes in, you know, to so that you could breathe you know, better air, oxygen. And if there's anyone with a virus, at least not a lot of virus will go into the system. Because, you know, kids, right? When we have family members, especially kids, if they get infected, what do you want to do with them? Put them somewhere? Of course not. You put them inside the house because we take care of them. But the most important thing is we need to open the windows, the doors for ventilation especially if you have sunlight let the light comes in in your house because it kills the bacteria and the viruses you know as i was talk talking before your beddings if you have not actually put out your your pillows for so long please put them in the sunlight like 12 o'clock in the morning so it kills all those viruses and germs and then you put a new sheet on them so that way your house is if you have somebody who's sick you know, it the the virus does not stay in the house because if they go outside, if you put those uh, pillows, blankets outside, the UV ray rays kills the the virus, the viruses and the bacteria, not just the COVID. Um, and you still, if you don't know those persons, still stay six feet away or limit your contact. Okay, if you don't know that person, limit your contact less than 15 minutes because 15 minutes or more, that's more the more virus that you inhale, right? It goes into your system. So the other thing, one more time, one more thing, um, supplements, okay? I know that there's so many people who are drink, taking all these supplements to help them boost their immune system. But the only, you know, the best Thing that you could really take is always free right the sunlight vitamin d that's the one that is actually have randomized study already that it helps build our immune system because um if you look at the what you call this the structure you know one of some of you probably took chemistry the structure of vitamin d is the same as the structure of the testosterone, you know, our uh, hormones that help us becomes, become um, healthy. So how could you get, you know, vitamin D? Because I know some of us will just say, okay, let's take a pill. Yeah, the pill is good. It's for, but you need to take like 400, 4,000 units, to, you know, to make you, to, to be effective right? Why don't you just go outside, right? Why don't you, especially in the Philippines when there's a lot of sunlight and, you know, light and when you go outside, it actually make, makes you happy than just staying inside the house. You know, if winter time comes, of course, you know, 
you know, us who have winter have to stay inside. So then we take vitamin D. But, you know, it's free in the Philippines. But be sure that when you go out in the sun, do not wear clothes to cover your skin. You need the, your skin, the cholesterol in your skin in order for that vitamin D to be uh, absorbed by your body and by used by your body. So don't take a shower before going outside, okay, to, to get your vitamin D. Vitamin C, okay, very important. There is no specific amount or maximum amount that you could consume to protect you with vitamin C. I take a thousand milligrams, okay, once a day. And, um, but in the Philippines, you have all these fruits, like a lot of citrus that you could take vitamin D also. So, and peppers have lots of vitamin D. Uh, the other, th the other thing is, um, I was talking about before, you know, how, you know, this, I'm sorry, you know, this lifestyle change that I was telling you, this is to prevent you from getting COVID, but at the same time, it also, you could also use the same thing when you have COVID so that you recover early. So, but if you have COVID, okay. The best thing that you could help yourself is get a pulse oximeter if you could afford it. Okay, you put the you put that pulse oximeter in your finger that doesn't have nail polish because you need to check your oxygen. Your oxygen because the COVID um, positive people sometimes, you know, they these are happy hypoxic. You know, their oxygen could be 80s and they don't feel it. Okay, they just drop dead. So very important, you know, that you look at your family member that they are not blue, the lips is not blue, their tongue is not blue, and you could put an, a pulse oximeter on the finger without nail polish, and they need to sit down, you know, and relax a few seconds, because you don't, don't look at the number right away, because the, the machine has to uh, recalculate and actually um, have to see the amount of oxygen in your blood that's what it is the pulse oximeter so you have like a few seconds and then you look at the number and then your your magic number is 92 okay if it's below 92 if you're short of breath you need to go to the hospital because you need oxygen but if it's more than 92 even if you're short of breath take use your inhaler okay um because that would open up your lungs and you could breathe better and you learn and do the techniques that I've taught you before. Okay, I want to stop here because I need to be out of here at 8 o'clock. I have an appointment. So tomorrow, um, we'll talk about more, you know, about the medicine and the requirements, you know, when people should take the vaccine because I'm sure a lot of people are, uh, wondering why you know some takes the got the vaccine and others were were not given the vac vaccine but the requirements for receiving the vaccine is the same all over the world i don't know why you know in some parts of the philippines you know they are not following the requirements of world health organization and you know we do them also in the here in the us so you need to know the requirements so that you could get your vaccine if it's available. The key here to stop this pandemic is that people to get the vaccine, okay? Now God is giving us a chance, you know, to be healthy and to protect ourselves from the virus. So we need to grab that chance. So let's take a few deep breaths. And put ourselves in the midst of the angels and saints. Because they're praying with us, especially our guardian angels. This is the best time for our guardian angels. When we are all praying together. In the name of the Father, of the Son, of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Come, O Holy Spirit. Come by means of the powerful intercession of the Immaculate Heart of Mary, your well-beloved spouse. Come dwell in our hearts and in our mind. 
so that we see areas of our lives that keep on offending God and that we'll be courageous to change our path so we'll be pleasing to Him. Help us to see the suffering of Jesus and the cross every time He sees us doing a mortal sin. Now let's invite our favorite saints to intercede for us. Saint Monica, intercede for all those who have problems with their spouse, especially those with drinking problems and wayward children. Give them strength so they will continue to guide their family and not abandon them. St. Francis de Assisi, intercede for us that there's always be peace in our hearts and we could be a channel of peace to others. St. John the Baptist, intercede for us that we are, our hearts will always be burning to spread the gospel and to speak up the truth even if we are persecuted. St. Dymphna, intercede for those who have problem with mental illness, depression, panic attacks, and insomnias. St. Clair, intercede for us so we will detach ourselves from this material world and always focus towards eternal life. Now let's invite our departed friends and family to pray with us today. I'm inviting my grandparents and my two godparents, Father Futu and Father Sidantes. We are now on our ninth day of surrender to Jesus Novena and also the Divine Mercy. Pray always in readiness to surrender and you will receive from it great peace and great rewards even when I confer on you the grace of emulation, of repentance and love. Then what does suffering matter? It seems impossible to you. Close your eyes and say with all your soul, Jesus, you take care of it. Do not be afraid. I will take care of things and you will bless my name by humbling yourself. A thousand prayers cannot equal one single act of surrender. Remember this well. There is no novena more effective than this. O oh Jesus, I surrender myself to you. Take care of everything. Jesus, I surrender myself to you. Take care of everything. Jesus, I surrender myself to you. Take care of everything. Jesus, I surrender myself to you. Take care of everything. Jesus, I surrender myself to you. Take care of everything. Jesus, I surrender myself to you. Take care of everything. Jesus, I surrender myself to you. Take care of everything. Jesus, I surrender myself to you. Take care of everything. Jesus, I surrender myself to you. Take care of everything. Jesus, I surrender myself to you. Take care of everything. We adore you, O Lord, and we thank you for the many blessings we will receive, for answered prayers, for the gift of the Eucharist, so you always dwell in our hearts. Please give us a heart that will always burn to love you and to forgive those who have hurt us. 
We are binding our children and the children of the world in this rosary and the divine mercy novena. Mama Mary and St. Joseph buried them as you did with Jesus. We offer these prayers for the following intentions for all our leaders so they will protect life from conception to death and they'll always be thinking about the benefit of their constituents and not self-serving. For healing of those infected with COVID, especially Normai Tihap, Jared Paul Ercilia, Mila and Sam, Violeta Marfil, and Officer Angelito Manalo. For, and also for those who succumb to it, Nung Joman Ikle, Sir Ider, Edita Escamillan, Oyoy Istoluga, Nung Jin Espino, Josie Diagnetti, Larry Lehman, Kenneth Kosniki, Lucy Pido, Father Yubal, Helen Jess Mohinon, Paul Klein, and Larry DiMaio. For good health of those celebrating their birthday this month, especially Nonoy Jack, Michelle Gayaten, Pinky Dofeles, Nick Ervite, Mylene Estose, Ayesha Mina, Nelia Emanuel, Rosemary Ebreo, Tita Nori Mayo, Tita Ting Ting, Presi Di Guzman, Trino Gayaten, Marcy Alcibar, Juju Esmilia, Jen Ercilia, Malu Vero, Rowan and Michelle, Butch and Evelyn, and Toto Mina. For safety of all frontliners, especially my co-workers, the secretaries, paramedics, housekeepers, food services, transporters, the scribes, the storekeepers, especially the priests who are giving the last rites. For safety of all OFW, especially Kim Efondo, Dimpoligia, Gipres, Elena Telibo, Betpek Esperida, Lota Gayagas, Mila Dison, Mary Grace Yosoya, and Light Glyza Pabiano. For all IDPNs, so we will focus on our goal of building a culture of caring that we will rejoice together for all our successes, but also to protect those and defend those who could not speak up for themselves. For healthy pregnancy of Iris Rayoso, for holy angels parishioners who struggle in faith, health, relationship, and financial status, for those who are looking for jobs, may they find dignified work, and for those having financial difficulties, may they feel comfort from those who have plenty. For special intentions of Father Miguel, Marwen, Nang Baby Medetsielo, Eddie Vargas, Amy Olson, Mac John Pereira, Flora Bartosilio, Gigi Ecube, Dr. Sonny Nibiada Villa, Jerry Bill O'Brien, Lynn Wood, Carrie and Chris, Bal Boatner, Luz Biminda Sandig, Marilu Ilamparo, Coray Sabalaya, Tanalyon family, Nini Carol, and Larry G. For healing of body and spirit of the following, especially my patients, Sammy Madden, Leo Tolentino, Mugs Espania, Chris Pasaporte, Jan Ray Panes, Joan Rapp, Ibong Iskanlar, Carol Ipulong, Cecilia and Henry, A.J. Eliana, Elsa Esquera, Parker, Carol, Grace, Euphemia, Marina Perino, Benedicto Bordador, Patsy Arandia, Eric, Luci Santander, daughters of Mommy Letty, Mary Grace Idhan, Yvette, Jamie, Father Martin Nyland, Tita Ines, Nina, son of Tita Becky, Tita Eve, Tito June, Tito Roli, Tito Henry, Tito Elmer, Sally Ioy, Pacencia Estraza, Tito Enrico, Shet Mandak, Goldberg Family, Jesus Martinez, Rochelle Quintan, Kim Pan, Tang Wen, Luisa Alparo, Father Matthias Thelen, Evelyn Bolivar, Mario Makuha Manahan, Richard Eckley, Rosemary Oviedo, Christian Kai, Beatrice Echaleco, Father Biben, Beatrice Estopado, Tony Kivara, Valentin Talibo, Mario Idisan, Josefina Iscanlar, Jan Jezo Samonteza, Mateo Asuncion, Bernadette Macado, Lina Elera, Nick Ervite, Andrew Olson, Mary Grace Escobanias, Antonio Escamillan, Maria Lourdes, Antonio Rojas, Lucila Advincula, Garnet, Pamela and Vivian Estrada, Joyce Wiz, and Michael Widow. For those called by God ahead of us, may they be granted eternal rest to the loving embrace of our Father and comfort to their family, especially Manamari Coniscan Larp, 
Tita Pilar Cartagena, Grandma Marilyn, Victor Jr., Dan Ralph, Tita Nena Hinko, Tita Ore, Cosette de Guzman, Romeo Ilicania, Philip Garaga, Jay Estoral, Jonalyn Tabugsok, Maria Antiboy Meliesa, Adela Encibio Yugalca, Juan Escaba, Ua Esteba, Jose Monot, Lolin Guillén, Lilia Estoleros, Samuel Fabrigo, Lolita Echaleco, Mirna Makiling, Romeo Encinares, Sony Encanto, Sweet Emmanuel, Warlito Espirito, Nico Bustarga, Solficia Dula, Pablito Hilasan, Tito Moya, Sosimo Ilambre, Fredo Yugalca, Elsa Estraza, Mardi Calcetas, Auling Yunanga, Kurt Bustilio, Crisanto Estoleros, Heron Imulaga, Max Yucugal, Father Rene Regalado, Adelaida Estocado, Angeles Taton, Anthony Estrellanes Ribao, Felipe Edang, Angelo and Irene Loizaga, Antonio Escatron, Lourdes Lipianic, Charles Wiz, Menard Mina, Godfrey Atienza, MJ Iscanian, Mario Bashon and Antonio Gonzaga, Luisa Eleferia, Rogelio Ilumerag, Connie, Thelma Ben and Rafael Rapatan, Noe and Estela Hubero, Antonio Bolivar, Gregorio Encho, Francisco Panes, Rogelio Umilig, Louis Munoz, Peter Ofelia Torter, Danilo Tamises, Serino Priscilla and Vicente Macado, Anisita Eclavia, Alma Estribor, Lolita Esteba, Imet and Joval Esteta, Maria and Porferio Ilambre, Aida Asuncion, Munching and Inday Istoche, Willie De Ramas, Estrella Estel, Maria Allen Flores, Gemma Kudumal, Cynthia Gaville, Boyo Noblesa, Sidra Imboltorio, Arnold and Ireneo Eraldo, Jose and Beverly Chaveria, Fermina and Alberto Istember, Rosario Erdao, Joscoro Heredia, Jolito Galientes, Danilo Ilamparo, Eric Espada, and Soledad Sumbinlon. For the intentions of the prayer warriors of St. Hannibal, St. Augustine, St. John Paul II, Christ the Good Shepherd, Soldiers of Mary, St. Anthony ESD, and St. Monica, the real women, members of the Marian Movement for Priests, Father Peter Prokoskiewicz, please give them excellent health so they will continue to pray fervently for others. And for the persecuted Christians in Afghanistan, Haiti, and all over the world, may God give them strength and conversion of the persecutors. For all the intentions, worries, sufferings that we keep in the silence of our hearts, let's unburden our hearts and offer them all to Mama Mary. Now, let's free the souls in purgatory. Eternal Father, we offer you the most precious blood of your divine Son, Jesus, in union with the Masses said throughout the world today, for all the holy souls in purgatory, for sinners everywhere, for sinners in the universal church, those in my own home and within my family. Amen. Let's consecrate our family to the Holy Family. O Lord Jesus, you live in the home of Mary and Joseph in Nazareth. There you grew in age, wisdom, and grace as you prepare to fulfill your mission as our Redeemer. We entrust our family to you. O Blessed Mary, you are the mother of our Savior. At Nazareth, you cared for Jesus and nurtured him in a peace and joy of your home. We entrust our family to you. O Saint Joseph, you provided a secure and loving home for Jesus and Mary and gave us a model of fatherhood while showing us the dignity of work. We entrust our family to you. Holy family, we consecrate ourselves and our family to you. May we be completely united in a love that is lasting, faithful and open to the gift of new life. Help us to grow in virtue, to forgive one another from our hearts, and to live in peace all our days. Keep us strong in faith, persevering in prayer, diligent in our work, and generous toward those in need. May our home, a holy family, truly become a domestic church where we reflect your example in our daily life. Amen. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph, pray for us. Now let's pray for our priests and for the increase in vocation especially for our seminarian, especially for Toto Bob, Raphael Colombot, Clyde, and, and Clyde Espinosa, and Clifford. 
O Jesus, our great high priest, hear our humble prayers on behalf of thy priest. Give them a deep faith, a bright and firm hope, and a burning love which will ever increase in the course of their priestly life. In their loneliness, comfort them. In their sorrow, strengthen them. In their frustrations, point out to them that it is through suffering that the soul is purified and show them that they are needed by the church. They are needed by souls. They are needed for the work of redemption. O loving Mother Mary, Mother of Priests, take to your heart your sons who are close to you because of their priestly ordination and because of the power which they have received to carry on the work of Christ in a world which needs them so much. Be their comfort, be their joy, be their strength, and especially help them to live and to defend the ideals of consecrated celibacy. Amen. Today, we will meditate the joyful mystery. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and Jesus Christ, the only Son of our Lord, who was conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried, descended into dead. On the third day, he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of God, the Father Almighty. From then he shall come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body and life, everlasting amen our father in heaven hallowed be thy name thy kingdom come thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil amen hail mary full of grace the lord is with thee blessed are thou amongst women and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. The first joyful mystery. Okay, close your eyes and put yourselves in a small house in Bethlehem beside Mama Mary. The first jo joyful mystery is the Annunciation. Mary's message, God so loved you that for your sake he willed his only begotten son to become a man. In fulfillment, his father's will, Christ came to earth to redeem you and to show you the path to heaven. In this mystery, Jesus teaches you to love God effectively by doing His will. Dear Blessed Mother, you replied to God's angel, I am the servant of the Lord. Let it be done to me as you say. Simply and humbly, you made yourself available for the service God required. May I Never forget your lesson of prompt response to the Father's will. Amen. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those who need most of thy mercy. The second joyful mystery is the visitation. Mary's message. Christ had hardly taken flesh and already he wanted to be shared. He longed to give Zachary, Elizabeth, and the unborn John the joy of his presence. In this mystery, Jesus invites you to share him with your fellow man. Freely you received, freely give. Dear Blessed Mother, your example of charity and apostolic zeal is a precious lesson. Make us understand how to preserve the faith by sharing Christ with others, less privileged spiritually. Whenever we keep our faith in Christ to ourselves, please remind us to care and share, at least through the charity of prayer. Amen. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those who need most of thy mercy. The third joyful mystery is the Nativity. Mary's message at Bethlehem. The kindness and graciousness of God, our Savior, appeared to invite a sin-saddened world to rejoice. The herald angels greeted Christ's birth as a good news of great joy. You believe in Christ, so be full of joy. He gives you a, a pledge of endless bliss in His presence. Dear Blessed Mother, help us to serve the Lord with gladness. May we put away all gloom and sadness to look like a Christian firmly convinced of God's loving kindness and mercy. Let us be glad in Him and joyful because of His Spirit. Then like you, we can be a cause of joy to all others around us. Amen. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those who need most of thy mercy. The fourth joyful mystery is the presentation. Mary's message. When you were baptized, you were presented to the Lord in his temple. You then agreed to serve him faithfully on earth that you might worship him and be her, his forever. May this rosary mystery always recall your baptismal promises and inspire you to live up to them. Prayer. Thank you, dear Blessed Mother, for turning my thoughts to my first meeting with Christ at the baptismal font. In joining his company, I rejected, or we rejected, evil and sin by pledging lifelong fidelity to Christ. Virgin most faithful, please pray to the Lord for us that we may remain totally and generously dedicated to Him and keep our baptismal promises. Amen. 
Our Father in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, Forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those who need most of thy mercy. The fifth joyful mystery, the finding in the temple. In your life, also there will be strange divine doings to puzzle you. You may wonder in dismay what God wants to accomplish. You may wish to probe in prayer to discover his hidden reasons. God does not ask you to understand his doings fully, but rather to align your will with his, with his in a complete filial trust. Dear Blessed Mother, the thousand whys on my lips are not always the best response to God. May his Holy Spirit teach us as we taught you as he taught you to accept his ways without always asking god to prove again his care of us may we always reverence his presence with us as another living temple of his glory amen our father in heaven hallowed be thy name thy kingdom come thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those who need most of thy mercy. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of Mercy, our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee do we cry, poor banished children of Eve. To thee do we send our sighs, mourning and weeping in this valley of tears. Turn then, most gracious, advocate thine eyes of mercy towards us, and after this, our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, whose only begotten Son, by his life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life. Grant, we beseech thee, that by meditating upon these mysteries of the most holy rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. Prayer to St. Michael. St. Michael the Archangel, defend us in the day of battle. Be our safeguard against the wickedness and snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray, and though thou a prince of the heavenly host, by the power of God, cast into hell Satan and all the other evil spirits who prowl about the world, seeking the ruins of souls. Amen. May the divine assistance remain always with us, and may the souls of the faithful departed, through the mercy of God, rest in peace. Amen. Let's pray for our Holy Father, Pope Francis. The Lord preserve him and give him life, and make him blessed upon earth, and deliver him not to the will of his enemies. Lord, source of eternal life and truth, give to your shepherd Francis a spirit of courage and right judgment, a spirit of knowledge and love, by governing with fidelity those entrusted to his care. May he, a successor to the Apostle Peter and Vicar of Christ, build your church into a sacrament of unity, love, and peace for all the world. We ask this through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. Now let's pray the Divine Mercy Novena. Today. Bring to me souls who have become lukewarm and immerse them in the abyss of my mercy. Most compassionate Jesus, you are compassion itself. I bring lukewarm souls into the abode of your most compassionate heart. In this fire of your pure love, let these tepid souls who like corpses filled you with such deep loathing be once again set aflame. O most compassionate Jesus, Exercise the omnipotence of your mercy and draw them into the very ardor of your love and bestow upon them the gift of holy love for nothing is beyond your power. Eternal Father, turn your merciful gaze upon lukewarm souls who are nonetheless enfolded in the most compassionate heart of Jesus. Father of mercy, I beg you by the bitter passion of your Son and by his three-hour agony on the cross, let them to glorify the abyss of your mercy. Amen. Now, on every bead, remember your friends and family who are suffering. Intertwine their suffering to the passion of Jesus Christ so they will have redemptive value. You expire, Jesus. But the source of life gushed forth for souls, and the ocean of mercy opened up for the whole world. O fount of life, unfathomable divine mercy, envelop the whole world and empty yourself out upon us. 
O blood and water which gush forth from the heart of Jesus as a fount of mercy for us, we trust in you. O blood and water which gush forth from the heart of Jesus as a fount of mercy for us, we trust in you. O blood and water which gush forth from the heart of Jesus as a fount of mercy for us, we trust in you. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, the only Son of our Lord, who was conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. On the third day, he rose again. He ascended into heaven, seated at the right hand of God, the Father Almighty. From then, he shall come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body and life everlasting. Amen. Eternal Father, we offer you the body, blood, soul, and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. Eternal Father, we offer you the body, blood, soul, and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. Eternal Father, we offer you the body, blood, soul, and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. 
for the sake of his sorrowful passion. Have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. Eternal Father, we offer you the body, blood, soul, and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. Holy God, Holy Mighty One, Holy Immortal One, have mercy on us and the whole world. Holy God, Holy Mighty One, Holy Immortal One, have mercy on us and the whole world. Holy God, Holy Mighty One, Holy Immortal One, have mercy on us and the whole world. Eternal God, in whom mercy is endless and the treasury of compassion inexhaustible, look kindly upon us and increase your mercy in us that in difficult moments we might not despair nor become despondent, but we great confidence submit ourselves to your holy will, which is love and mercy itself. Amen. Jesus, we trust in you, St. Faustina. Pray for us and the whole world, especially for those who are about to die on this day and have no one to pray for them. Jesus, have mercy on their souls. Amen. Thank you, Mama Mary, and all the angels and saints who have joined us today. Please bestow, bestow the same grace to those people who are not, who are, for those prayer warriors who are not here with us today because of Wi-Fi problems. Guide all of us that all our works and our words will be pleasing to God. And for those who are about to sleep, please give them a tranquil and undisturbed rest. We ask this to the mighty name of Jesus Christ, our Lord, who reigns forever and ever. Amen. Thank you, everyone. Hello, Ati Nori and Kuya Alan. Thank you for joining from Virginia. <clears throat> and Lucy, I'm glad that you are better. Thank you for joining from California. And Beth, oh, my friend Beth, thank you for being here. Of course, my tita, tita Ninet, tita Carmen. And Tita Mimi, thank you for joining. And thank you for joining, Vice Mayor Juvik. Thank you. And, oh, hi, Mary Grace. Thank you for joining from Singapore. Tita Fe, happy blessed Saturday. So, I'll see you guys tomorrow. I have to work, so pray for me that I'm going to get out on time so that I have sleep before we start the prayer. Okay? But you know, I thank everyone because I asked you yesterday to intercede for me, to ask, to uh, pray for my intentions. And of course, God is good and, you know, He bless me with what I ask. So, I'll post it, okay? God bless everyone. <laughs>